everyone. Welcome to Scratch Coding Ninja. Hello everyone. So today's lesson is going to be about text to speech. I will be using I will first demonstrate what this does and I'll be making a project later deeper on. So yeah, let's begin. So text to speech um in or is basically like you um the you type something and then the computer will say, say it out loud. So in order to enable that, what you want to do is you want to go to this bottom thing, extensions, add extension, click on that. You have all sorts of extension, including like music, pen, video sensing, and text to speech, which we're interested in. You have other stuff, but you might need to buy them first of all. But the text to speech doesn't really yeah so first we enable that now yeah text to speech doesn't have that much a lot so as a result we're gonna be making a bigger project so first of all let's just make a simple project which includes just saying with the cat just ask say something all right um say some thing and wait and then what we want to do is we want to set the language to English, set voice to alto, which just is the medium, and then speak whatever the answer is. So now, when I say something like, okay, all right, um, hello, cat, let's say. Hello, cat. Yeah, you heard that? I hope you did. So... Um, yeah, so that's what text-to-speech is. Pretty simple. Three blocks. So now, what, we, what I'm interested in doing is we want we I'm we want a conversation to happen. And this time, it's not gonna ask because we're gonna actually write it in the program. So yeah, so um, first of all, we're gonna need another character. So uh uh let's say uh yeah all right let's say andy i think we might need to flip him flip horizontal flip horizontal flip horizontal and flip horizontal Yeah. All right. So we have Andy. Let's put him in this costume. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make. In this case, I'm, I'm interested in making the scratch cat say something like a riddle, like thing. I'm gonna need to use broadcasting because yeah, it's a conversation. They all depend on each other to give messages so first of all um when let's say let's say the cat says a real i mean for i mean you can do whatever you want but but i'm just gonna show you the first few lines so say hey do you want to do you want me to say a riddle and yeah text to speech speak whatever this is so we and then we want this to broadcast the message let's say it's called riddle time Oh, uh, this was supposed to be for Sprite 1. Alright, that's how to duplicate code. You just want to just drag it to your Sprite. And there you go, we have it here. Broadcast riddle time. Now when this, when Andy receives riddle time, then he'll say, 
All right. All right. And he's going to say it. So slowly and slowly, just like that, you're going to, you'd want to, um, you want to make a converse conversation. So I'll just, um, I'll just, uh, I'll show you my, uh, my project that I have made, um, now, just not, just right now. Alright, so, um, I created my riddle, it's, yeah, it's pretty much done. So, yeah, uh, I'll show you, um, I made this a bit simpler because I changed the voice, and, uh, yeah, I deleted the looks so that it doesn't look too long. So, yeah, let me, um, show it to you. Hey, do you want me to say a riddle? All right, sure. So, there was a man who went for a walk, but when he was on his way back home, it was raining. However, he did not get a single hair wet, and he went without any rain protection. How did this happen? Hmm, I don't know. This is because he was bald. He didn't have any hair. All right, simple riddle, but yeah, it still, it still uses text-to-speech. So I hope that you enjoyed this lesson. It's and uh, it's a bit short. And yeah. Bye bye. Thank you for watching my video. If you have any questions, please write them down in the comment section below. If you liked the video, please click like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so that you can get notified when I upload my next video.